Hey guys, this is Steve from Trim That Weed. Today we're talking about how to get rid of moss in your yard. This video will explore everything you need and provide methods that will keep your garden free from unwanted moss. So make sure you stick around till the end. Use herbicides. Herbicides are a common way of getting rid of moss. Several herbicides in the market are rich with iron and will target and kill moss in your lawn while helping your grass grow. The best time to use this chemical method on moss is when the moss is at its peak. Additionally, you need to be careful while getting the best herbicide to kill moss. Get one that specifically targets moss and not a wide range of weeds. Deal with drainage. Poor drainage leads to your lawn having a damp environment, which is perfect for moss to grow. So, in this case, always ensure that there's good drainage to prevent water from pooling and leading to the growth of moss. Furthermore, if there is shade on your lawn, you want to get rid of it to ensure that the grass receives enough light and that moss does not get a favorable condition to thrive. Use a DIY solution. If you can't get effective herbicides to kill moss in your yard, you could mix lukewarm water with baking soda, 2 gallons of water, or gentle dish soap, 3 gallons of water to create your own herbicide. Fill this solution in a garden sprayer and spray it on your lawn, saturating in areas where moss has grown. This solution is favorable to grass and shouldn't harm your turf. Aerate the thatch. Another effective method of dealing with moss on your lawn is by scarifying and aerating the lawn to ensure enough oxygen reaches the soil. The best time to do this is when winter is approaching the end. Having good aeration allows the grass roots to receive enough moisture and oxygen, hence supporting the growth of grass rather than the lawn. Regulate the soil's pH. Acidic soil is favorable for the growth of moss. Therefore, if the above methods aren't working for you, you could take the soil for testing to determine its acidity. If it's too acidic, add lime during the fall season to allow it to penetrate the soil effectively. Neutralizing your soil provides harsh conditions for moss to grow while supporting the growth of grass. So there you have it. Removing moss from your lawn is important to allow your grass to thrive. Do you have any comments or questions? Make sure you drop them below and get a like on this video. Until next time.